What's going on, everybody? Vince Goodrum here. It is Monday evening. Just got back home from the gym from pumping up those weights and everything like that. I'm going to have myself some turkey chili, two slices of Gouda after I take my shower. But the reason why I'm making this video is, you know, once again, it's 2021 and the new rage for this year is vegan junk food. It, you know, I was up there turning the news stations and, you know, as usual, you see the doc, you know, Dr. Oz and all these other bullshit uh, talk shows in the morning and everything like that. And they're talking about these new vegan recipes and shit. It's even on YouTube to where they're talking about this new vegan junk food saying it's a whole lot more healthy. Well, if you think it's healthy, then you are wrong, wrong. The fact of the matter is is that vegan junk food is still fucking junk food, period. I mean, so what if they, you know, one recipe I saw up there, they was up there taking out, they, they were showing, hey, let's, you can make a, now make a cake without eggs in it there. Ooh, that makes it a lot more healthy. Considering that you still have all the sugar and all fucking chocolate in it and all the other garbage that's in it there. You know, even all the enormous amount of strawberries, that's still fruit sugar. The fact of the matter is, is that in order to keep your weight down and stay healthy, then the amount of calories that you take in has to be less than what you expend out there. Any extra calories that you do not use during the day, it is stored as excess fat. Period. You still need to eat five small meals a day at least. That's what I pretty much do. Five meals a day. If you're eating only two or three meals throughout the day, what's going to happen is it puts your body into starvation mode. And then when you eat, you know, your body's going to hoard that as fat, basically. These are just good old time-honored principles as far as to not only losing weight, but also keeping your weight in balance, basically. You know, and it's pretty simple to do. Now, as far as some of these vegan junk food type things, you know, the issue is, is that, you know, a lot of them still have a high amount of cholesterol. You'd be kind of surprised, I mean, because, you know, things such as coconut oil, you know, they're up there slathering that shit on like it, like it's fucking cake frosting and stuff like that. That has a high amount of saturated fat in there, even more than a fucking egg or so forth. And you add that along with all the other sunflower oils and stuff like that. Some of this stuff looks kind of greasy there, you know. It's just a bucket of calories. It is vegan technically, but it's junk food, you know. So this is a very short video because, you know, it's... It's pretty much cut and dry, you know? Vegan junk food is still junk food. If you want to stay in shape, it doesn't matter whether you're a vegan, whether you run a normal diet like myself or a carnivore diet, even though the carnivore diet and the vegan diet is stupid. But if you are going to do those diets, you'll still need to abide by those healthy guidelines there because junk food is still junk food. Me, I may have a candy bar maybe once a week or even a month there. I'm not big on candy bars or sugar or anything like that, you know. Uh, that's just me, basically. I, I've never had a real tolerance for sugars and sweets and everything like that, you know. Uh, but if you are going to do it, you still got to eat in moderation and make sure that you're not packing on excess calories because your body's just going to store it as fat, whether it's even if it is... Uh, vegan. Vegan is such is just a catch word, basically. That's all it is. It's no different than those fucking Atkins bars here that are still in the stores as well as the zone bars. You know, even though they have net uh, carbohydrates in it there, like one or two, they have a high amount of fat in it. A lot of those bars are like six or seven hundred calories. I mean, I mean, a Big Mac has less calories than that. I mean, you're I mean, it's, it's nuts. It's just completely nuts. So 2021, the same old bullshit is still happening. 
And the catch word of this year is vegan junk food. But take advice from the great one and just stick with what works. That is eating in moderation, eating small meals, and taking in the appropriate amount of cal uh, calories in either to build muscle or to lose weight, whichever your position is in life as far as the what you're doing. And that's all I got to say today, people. Take care.